now talk about application software. These are sets of programs developed by programmers in order to perform specific types of jobs like beautifying the documents, doing calculations, arranging data in an organized manner, making airline or railway reservation system, etc. Computer languages are used to create these types of software. The application software can be further divided into two categories. General Purpose Application Software Packages These software can perform many tasks to fulfill the general needs of people. Some of the examples of general purpose application software are Word processing software a word processor helps us to create professional looking documents quickly and efficiently. It provides many features to change the appearance of text in the desired manner. You can easily add, delete, rearrange or beautify the text and can even produce a hard copy of the document as per the requirement. Examples Microsoft Word, WordPad, OpenOffice.org Writer, etc. Electronic Spreadsheet A spreadsheet program helps you to perform calculations and display the data in the form of a chart to analyze in a better way. It is used for creating documents to manage and organize numerical data. Some of its application areas are financial accounting, cost analysis, interest calculations, etc. VisiCalc was the first computer spreadsheet program. Examples Microsoft Excel, Lotus 123, OpenOffice.org, Calc, etc. Database Management System, DBMS. Each one of us uses database unknowingly in our daily routine. For example, managing telephone directories, payroll information, etc. Database software helps us to arrange and store a large amount of information in an organized manner. You can easily create, add, find, update, sort, search, print and retrieve the information stored in a database. Examples Microsoft Access, OpenOffice.org Base, FoxPro, Oracle, etc. Presentation Software It is used to present an idea of concept in a lively manner. This software helps you to create and display slides on a computer or a projector for business and educational purposes. It lets you create slides, charts, animation and video clips. Examples Microsoft PowerPoint, OpenOffice.org Impress, Adobe Flash, etc. Desktop Publishing Software This application helps you to combine both text and graphic features to design professional documents like newsletters, printed forms, advertisements, books, brochures, posters, magazines, etc. Examples Coral Draw, Adobe InDesign, Quark Express, etc. Graphics Software It is used to create images such as charts, graphs, photographs, logos, cartoons and much more. Examples Paint, Photoshop, AutoCAD, Dreamweaver, etc. Multimedia Software It is used to create video, animation, sound, graphics and text with a high degree of interaction. Examples Game Software, Windows Media Player, Windows Movie Maker, etc. 
Special Purpose Application Software Customized Software The software which are designed to meet the specific needs of any user are called Specific Purpose Application Software. Examples Tally, Busy, etc. Such software are also known as Customized Software. Some of the customized software are Reservation System Billing system, payroll system, etc. Let us find out the difference between system software and application software. System software. System software is a type of program installed to control the operations of a computer system and run the application programs. Application software. Application software is installed as per the requirements of the user. It utilizes the capability of a computer on which it is installed. System software includes programs such as compilers, system utilities, debuggers, drivers, assemblers, etc. Application software includes graphics, software, word processors and spreadsheet programs, etc. You cannot interact with system software while working on a computer as it runs in the background. A user can interact with application software while performing different activities. System software can run independently of the application software. Application software cannot run without the presence of the system software. Students, let's know more. Software is usually written in high-level programming languages that are easier and more efficient for humans to use, closer to natural language than machine language. High-level languages are compiled or interpreted into the machine language object code. Let us understand the Operational Support Systems OSS. Operational Support System is a special type of software installed by communication service providers to operate, monitor, analyze and manage computer or telephone network system on the client's computer. Operational Support System OSS is also called Operation Support System. It is often installed on the server computer and is mainly used for supporting network processes to maintain the network inventory, configure network components, provision services and manage faults.